Hey, what's up guys, MKBHD here. Now, as you probably already have seen, this project from Google was recently made public called Google Glass has gotten a lot of buzz in the last couple of hours, really. I slept on it and I thought about it, and I think it's about time we take a little bit of a deeper analysis in this sort of augmented reality thing. So let's take a look at these Google Glasses. By the way, if I sound like I'm sick, it's because I'm sick. So let's first start off with the video that Google put out for them. Looks like the guy woke up and he's already wearing his jeans and his Google glasses, but that's cool because I'd probably sleep in my glasses too if I was a beta tester. Anyway, he's going along with his day and then he gets this notification that pops up in the corner. And then he is somehow able to bring this notification into focus and then do some actions with it before he releases it. Now, when I see this, I'm really, really hoping that there's a way to be able to choose when the notification goes from the corner to the main focus. Because if you're doing something important like, oh, I don't know, driving a car, uh, you might want to be able to leave that notification in the corner for a while until you're not busy anymore. So I'd, I'd like to know if you like, there's some eye gestures that are going on, if this guy's like tapping his forehead or if he's nodding or something. Something to get the notification to be in your control. Very, very important. Anyway, he uses Google Maps, he navigates to this bookstore, he walks into the bookstore, he's waiting for his friend there, and as he walks in, he opens up this dialogue and says out loud to nobody in the store, Where's the music section? Now, if you thought people looked ridiculous wearing Bluetooth headsets and talking to nobody, at least you could tell, like there was something on their ear you noticed after a while. With this Google Glass, it's kind of just like someone walking up to you, saying something to nobody, nodding in approval, and walking away. I don't know, it just seems a little bit, it's the next level of that Bluetooth thing. I don't know what it's going to look like, but I, I'm definitely interested to see how it works. Anyway, what I liked about this video were the tons of Google services that I saw that are already on Android like Google Calendar, like Google Notifications with Latitude and navigation through Google Maps and photo sharing through Google Plus, you know, instantly being able to take a picture. That's really cool, and I like that. What I don't know, and if I don't know if I'm gonna like or not, is how you actually control these things. You know, if you're blinking incessantly or if you're nodding your head from side to side looking like a crazy person, I don't know. Uh, leave a thumbs up if you want me to try to get like beta testing hands on these. I don't know how it's gonna work. Maybe it's gonna be like a Chromebook pilot program, but. Uh, I really, really, really want to be one of the first people to use this. Also, Google Glass will probably not be the final name. It's the name of the project that Google unveiled, but it's also still in sort of a super alpha testing, apparently. Uh, I was trying to think of other names for it, maybe Google Goggles. I mean, that's already a product, but that also doesn't really resonate well with the Android or the average Joe, Google Goggles. Like, no one wants goggles, but I figured Google Eye sounds kind of cool. I don't know. Leave your th If you have a comment, if you think there's a better name out there for it, Leave it in the comments section below on this YouTube video. Other than that, yeah, augmented reality is definitely the future, uh, and Google putting ads in it is also definitely the future. Hopefully not obtrusive ads, but like we've seen, Google it makes a lot of money from ads, and it'll be uh, interesting to see where they take it from here. Either way, thanks for watching this video. Stay tuned for a very special video coming up this Sunday, so if you're not already subscribed, you're gonna want to do that, and I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.